magazine because she heard they were doing a spread on the show she did in Milan. She didn't tell me I'd see her all over her boss. And I'm really starting to wonder well, what else my fiance isn't telling me.
I, uh, Cole dropped the books that you sent him, and, and uh, he wanted me to thank you. Good. How's he doing? Well, he survived his first Christmas in prison. That's about the best I can say. What's your news? Natalie and I are getting married. Not news. You know why I'm here. We're happy, Marty. Please don't tell him. And your tone changed when you mentioned a third person trying to break up a couple. Yes, well, that is what Echo is trying to do to Charlie and me. Ever since that damn DNA test proved that she and Charlie are Rex's parents, that woman has insinuated herself into my life, into my home. I am sick of it. I know, I sound like a broken man. I didn't realize you were having this much trouble. You must have been the only person in town who didn't. When Nora, before Christmas, she and I were commiserating about our respective situations. And what situation does Nora have? Oh, I'm sorry, I shouldn't have said anything. I can't betray confidence. Um, I understand. But I kind of know what's going on, because Bo confided in me. I did not warn you. I need to be kidnapped by that awful man. That's terrible. And, and, and he was torturing her psychologically. A bullet was just too good for him. I, I don't get what he was doing. S sending text messages, supposedly from Nora to Bo, urging Bo to sleep with his secretary. I mean, who does that? That doesn't make any sense at all. No. Did you know that that man was Inez's ex-husband? Uh, I did, yes. You know, Nora thinks Inez put him up to it. Well, you know Inez. Do you think she's capable of that? Vicky, I really don't know. I find it so hard to imagine anyone going to that extent to get between Bo and Nora. I swear to you, Rat, this wasn't payback. This had nothing to do with Sam Rappaport. I never set out to hurt you. Then why did you keep her working for you when I told you over and over again all she wanted to do was get you into bed? What? Why did you make me feel like some sort of crazy, jealous fool when all along I was right? Oh, but I never wanted to make you feel that way. <laughs> Why did you tell her those things, all those intimate details about our life? Why would you share that with that woman? All she wanted to do was use it against me. My God, she used those texts to, to lure you? I still can't believe that Inez has anything to do with any of this. Oh, my God! You're still defending her? No. no. Do you think it was just coincidence that I ended up being kidnapped and tied and gagged and molested by her ex-husband when Inez had just gotten you all alone in her apartment? Do you think that was coincidence? I don't know this makes any sense to me. I... No, but because Inez, you know, she couldn't hurt anybody, you know. Right? Who really is the injured party here, about? You are. Because I betrayed you. And I betrayed our marriage. I wish I could just turn everything back and erase it all, but I can't. All I can do is tell you that nothing like this will ever happen again.
Canadians are vitamin D deficient at some point in the year, get the benefits of vitamin D with D drops. This one drop a day provides you with vitamin D. And with D drops for adults, babies, and kids, everyone can get the amount that's right for them. Tasteless and odorless, D drops can be taken alone or added to drinks or food. Plus, each D drop is peanut, wheat, and gluten free. For a pure and simple way to get the sunshine vitamins in just one drop, try D drops. Brand Power, helping you buy better. When we told Hilton that new Campbell's Light Ready to Enjoy soups are made with less salt than the soups we made five years ago, he wondered, will they be delicious? So we showed him. Hilton rediscovered flavor here, here, and here. And thanks to new Campbell's Light Minestrone with 25% less calories, he discovered a delicious way to help manage weight here. Look for the blue band, Campbell's. Delicious just got healthier. Ryan, it is simply lovely to see you. Mmm, quite different from the last time we met. It's almost that time again. Time for me to take your folks serious. What's that? Ah, oh, yes, it's the stink of your undoing. Let's just see what happens on the court. Indeed. You can defend it. Mmm. They bring the EIU versus Kelowna in the Island Rivalry Series. Welcome to Today's Today. Now, over the last few months, we've introduced you to a variety of exercises that you can do for your core. Oftentimes, we've been encouraging you to get off of your back and work on your core using a ball, weight, plank positions, and the list goes on. However, some of you are more comfortable lying on your back than doing a traditional crunch. So Connie Bowley, the founder of CU Fit Personal Training, breaks down the proper way to do it if you so choose. Doing something uh, in the crunch that you see on. Uh, yeah, and uh, this can actually hurt somebody. All those things that are done incorrectly can hurt people. But um, this crunch, uh, we will, a lot of people, if they're doing it incorrectly, they're going to feel it in the wrong spot. Maybe the neck. Okay, so they'll feel it mainly in the neck muscles. What happens in a crunch is people tend to pull on the neck, right? There we go. go. Let's right? do it wrong. Yeah. This isn't really how you do them. <laughs> okay, so people tend to pull on their neck. Right. And we see a lot of contraction going on through the neck. And really, uh, we're seeing a vibration through the head. So a way to alleviate this is to really open up the arm, okay, and to focus on just rotating through that rib cage. So when you lift, you're just rotating through the rib cage, not even focusing on your head at all. Your head is just simply resting in your hand. And it makes it a lot harder to do. Totally. It's a lot more concentrated. The other thing that I tell people is you can put your tongue on the roof of your mouth, which is going to help relax those neck muscles. Okay, and these are for individuals who really cannot uh, seem to get rid of that neck pain when they're doing a crunch. Okay, and then you can't tap either. Mm -mm. You're focusing on the exercise. Mm -hmm. That's perfect. An interesting tip there is actually tough, uh, tougher to perform the crunch with your elbows back, but you need to be aware of where they are and how much you're using them. The hands cupping the head is usually the best way. The tummy stem does all the work. I'm Leanne Lang, and that's today for that. Can I ever forgive you? Oh, I don't know whether I can believe you. You say this happened once, that it's not an affair, that it's that it'll never happen again, but you're telling me all of this. Why? Because you got caught. I mean, I think that's the biggest problem I have here. It is the biggest problem. This is my problem with this. You weren't going to tell me. You you weren't going to tell me. And the only reason why you did was because Matthew, our son, forced you to. I should have come clean right away, and I didn't. And that, that was a mistake, but it was because I didn't want to hurt you. Since I knew that there was never going to be a repeat. Really? Yes.
just hope that despite Nora's concern, Inez cannot get between them. I certainly hope not. Do you really? I mean, did you mean that? Yeah, why? Um, I think for a while it looked as if you were never going to stop holding a grudge against your brother and Nora, and I think that would have been a terrible, terrible shame. Why waste time with resentment? <laughs> 